Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going Q1 Ooh. of the uh, bi weekly contest 147. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's bomb substring match matching pattern. Uh, yeah, uh, I mean, I think the, the key part is what this, what this is such almost almost obscene, but anyway. <clears throat> The key thing is noting that SNP only has 50 characters and one star. And this allows you to do uh, funky, uh, quick things. Um, but the canonical way of doing this is with dynamic programming. And honestly, I almost feel like I should have because it took me, um, you know, long enough to do it. Uh, four minutes, if I did it with dynamic programming, it probably would have been just as fast or even faster, honestly, um, because I, I spent a lot of time thinking about it. But honestly, I don't, I don't know what to say. Um, I think there's actually a cleaner way that someone mentioned, but basically I just do, if it starts with, if I find the first index of uh, prefix, the, and then I just check where the suffix is in the, the rest of the string, and that's it. And you could clean this, I mean, I, I would say clean this up, but you could say uh, if prefix is in S, not in S, then we return false, and then maybe something like, uh, yeah, and then, this thing is just going to be uh, plus, uh, let's see, do, 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 s, uh, s of index of prefix plus this, I think, right? Uh, but I even wrote it in a for loop because I, I, I wasn't sure about off by once and stuff during the contest. Um, but yeah, and you could click submit and that's good. I mean, eh, these things are very like you know lazy, but it it takes um, it, it takes advantage of the constraints that are given to us. So that's basically it. Um, this is a, 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 a I mean, some of this is a little bit uh, wonky in the sense that um, you know needle in a haystack. Um, this is actually linear time if Python implements this correctly, and so is this. So everything is pretty linear and pretty fast. The way that we do it, uh, honestly, because we only do it, we only need to do it for two things: the prefix and the suffix. And yeah, uh, that's pretty much all I have for this one. Uh, is it a queen solution? No. Is it good enough? Uh, I don't know. But that's all I have for this one. Thanks for watching, and you can watch me kind of struggle with this one live next. Go go go! Oh, where's that? Easy. Oh. Mm -hmm. well, this isn't that bad. I'm trying to figure out, out the easiest way to do this, um, but yeah, okay. Man, this is so annoying to do. <laughs> Does that work? Okay, so was that suffix is no empty or something? Okay, so hmm. Man, I'm spending too much time on this one, honestly, but Hmm. Um. Oh, yeah. 
That's what I was going to do. I forgot. What, I actually had this idea of it, and I was like, what am I doing? I forgot. Is a very dumb way of doing it, honestly. So dumb that it doesn't work. But uh, Then why is this not right? No oh, suffix. Why did I write this? Uh, I just woke up and I'm clearly not thinking right. Uh, okay, true for true. Okay, let's go. Okay, yeah, it wasn't that bad. It was slow for sure, but it wasn't that bad. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's contest, these problems, this description, everything in between. Stay good, stay healthy to go mental health. I'll see y'all later and take care. Bye bye.